Become good at this, man. That's a good question, man. Uh, first thing you gotta do is stop watching the streams and start practicing. That's the first thing you gotta do. Mm. Second thing you gotta do is subscribe before you actually stop watching the stream. Third thing you gotta do, believe in yourself. Do another pilot matchup chart? No idea. I'm not really talking. I'm not really thinking about doing anything else. Also, for pilot matchups, basically, like if you're MK Leo, you win. If you anybody else, you don't win. <laughs> That's how pilot matchup works. Awesome. <laughs> Arena ID <laughs> Arena ID is 2 D 4 H Y Why are you asking this? That's the code. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Is that even the right way to say it? My number one rival in Ultimate is Twitch Chat for sure. <laughs> I love making fun of you guys. VOD review is really good when like you're trying to beat someone in a specific because you did certain mistakes. And if you did those mistakes because you're bad, like if you don't know how to execute things, like for example, you miss like basically what I'm saying is that like usually VOD review is useful because you lost someone in a in a way where like you know that you made a mistake and that's what like the result of you losing. But if you lose to someone because he's like a lot better than you, and that's it, like I don't, I don't think I can help you with that. Like I, I need to help you in a different way. I wouldn't say VOD review will be completely useless for that, but it will probably not be a hundred percent. Casi me muero en pendejo cero, güey. ¿Por qué no te moriste? Porque no te pegó nada, porque estás grande y de todas maneras tienes un corvo bien pendejo. ¿Cómo te sientes sobre este match? Creo que es un buen match para Violet. Mi nair a veces no funciona, güey. Es como. Rob is like the only consistent character that can get out of my nair and not having to deal with like deck chasing and combos after that. Violet's best matchups. He does really good against DK for obvious reasons. He uh he gets infinite with the up B. He does really good against Cloud. He does good against like uh Captain Falcon. Like there's a lot of matchups that he wins automatically. I think Violet against the Shadows is really really good. Mm, he's good against Mario. He's good against Sephiroth. I wouldn't say he destroys a matchup, but he does like really well against some. If you can control Violet, like the Abby, Nair, shenanigans, like if you can control all of that, I believe the matchup should be out like a lot like a lot easier for you. If you just don't know how to deal with that, then uh the matchup is gonna be a lot harder. <laughs> like um like for example, Pyramithra. Pyramithra is a bad matchup. Like a bad matchup. Like it's one of the worst for Violet in my opinion. But it's doable because of like all the stuff you have. You're like a really big cheese gag there. The thing is that like I'm really good at cheesing. 
And of course, the like, this is spacing being really good. And like, being unpredictable. I don't know. So like, even if it's a bad matchup, Violet still got some stuff. Because basically, his worst thing is being slow, but everything else is just fine. It's like, his recovery is nice. The disadvantage is not that bad. Thanks to the recovery being really nice. Um, a neutral is also pretty good. <laughs> Dude, he was dead. I knew something bad was gonna happen. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> wow. Wow. It's incredibly broken, bro. That up B is so, so broken. That's Violet. Like, I don't even care if it's sore or not. Like, you are gonna get Gim. Like, I'm gonna go off stage and I'm gonna be safe. Because up B is really fucking big. It's like rough. <laughs> If Violet had Corrin Ron. Yeah. If he had Corrin Ron, he would be like super broken. But if he had Ike's or Marth Roy Lucina from Ron Speed, he would be unfair. He would be really unfair. Yo guys, don't forget to check out my Metafile profile in the description in case you want to get better. Alright, peace.